top honour places today. We're in the Spandard Church in uh, Pontypool. So this, uh, this church is very old. I'm going to bring up a bit of history in the, in the video. But uh, this, I don't want to really disclose the name of the church. You, you, probably, you probably see it anyway. But um, I'm joined by Wayne's World of Exploration, who's over there. And uh, we will be joined by Colliding Planets as well, who will be joining us shortly. So I hope you guys do enjoy the video, and we'll see you guys in it. Told the last time I was down there that where the grammar school is at the back of the church is like a big uh, gravestone. Yeah. So it's not a gravestone. You actually steps that go down. You lift this panel, and there's tunnels where the priests and like used to run and oh, hide. Oh, priests all again. Yeah, yeah. 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 And I said to him, I said, "Is it still open?" And it's like, "Yeah, it's still open." It's, I from like the eighth or Nobody, so. I didn't know about it. <laughs> <laughs> right, are you ready? I'm colliding planets here anyway. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> There's Wayne's World of Exploration. Yep. Back to it, mate. Back to it. Back mate. to it. <laughs> First time you two have met, anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah we've been mate, time mating mate. for a long time. <laughs> the, yeah, two wings. Uh, the two wings. <laughs> the two wings. The two wings are out again. <laughs> and the funny thing is, those are called myself Wings World. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was. It's called Well, you would have, because I would have got the. Mine would have been different then, wouldn't it? Yeah. I'd have to go that way. Well, when you've been colliding planets then. I've been picking planets. My son used to keep yeah, going. Yeah, you're going to call yourself. Yeah. You're going 22, Mike. I know. <laughs> Get in there. Get in there. I'm, I'm on, like, 2000... 2040 now. It's not bad for it, for just over a year doing it. No, that's good. Yeah, it's in yeah. 22. I don't know, three, three years now. Three years now and uh, 2040 subs. <laughs> I know, it's just... Like, we, we, we stand with Which way do you want to go first? I mean, it's up to you. I mean, I've, I've, I've took my footage and photos and stuff. I'll take a bit of footage as well of you. Too. Yeah, I'm going to do a bit of history anyway. In that church, it's a caddick. <laughs> I haven't got through that. I don't know. No. Oh, my God. Have you ever looked at the back of one of these? I have that one in there. Uh, you notice I always go the one in Swansea, back, yeah. To see how it's made. Yeah. How about the one in Swansea? Swansea? Yeah. Yeah. And it's all just wood carved. Crazy, isn't it? In the place. Look at that there, it's a, like an air thing there, look, it goes up and down, looks like. Air shaft, is it? Yeah, a bit like that. Yeah, it's a I'm going to look at a bit of mystery anyway, I'm going to stop recording. Tish listed buildings, here we go. Yeah, shine the light this way, because I'm going to do a, a bit of mystery. I'm the lighting man. <laughs> this church was built in 1821 to provide a home for the English-speaking con congregation of Pontypool, who were, then, who were then having to attend the Welsh-speaking services at St Caddox in Trevethy. The increase in local population meant it soon needed enlarging. This was done by the addition of an aisle, chancel and vestry by 1854, possibly, possibly designed by the Monmouth diocesan architect T.H. Wyatt, who had earlier enlarged St. Cadet. The two, two histories of the churches in Monmouthshire suggest later dates of 1871 and 1877 for the alterations, but their appearance supports a date of 1854. There you go, Stephen. Stretch the hands for the pieces. How do you I, I don't I don't I'm not a religious man. I'm not a religious man. <laughs> Hang on. I was taking the piss actually, but that was good. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Good deacon, yeah? No, it's just his neck. Oh, he was the deacon of this parish, yeah. Yeah, his name is um, Ernest Deacon, born 1844 and died in 1870. Or oh, was he Ernest the de He was he Ernest the deacon of the of the parish? Yeah. So they got the bishop and then they got the deacon. 
Look at the right design. Here. Oh, he designed it, yeah. yeah he designed it. The, uh, so it wasn't that other guy who read it. No. it was, so I'm guessing British listed buildings is wrong. Yeah. So, uh, Trevethin, oh, the Trevethin Church, that was the one, that was the one on the uh, St. Calix in Trevethin. Sacred to the memory of Anne Evans, spinster, who departed this life July the 6th, 1823. That's new. A warden of this church. 25 years. Oh, church? I didn't know church warden was a thing. <laughs> I don't know much. Hang on, shine your light back over here again. <laughs> yeah? I'll try this one again. Cool. Just touch the air. Uh... Alright. Nah, I don't. Oh, that does. Some of the keys work. Yes, sir. And it works, guys. Careful, though, because some of the, some of the strings. It still could, works, myself. Some of the strings can spring back. Some of them, what's that? These end ones. But they're getting stuck. If you've ever seen the film The Haunting, I'd be careful because uh, the strings can spring back and whip, whap you in the eye. <laughs> That's crazy how that works, still. One of these ones, it's just a, My old one piano. <laughs> and as you can see there, guys, uh, just across the way, you can see the town hall clock over there of Pontypool Town Hall as we are right next to it. Right next to the main town hall. I'm not sure if this one works. No, it's the state of it. There it is. Oops, sorry, wing. <laughs> the door's been made to be shut tight, isn't it? The power there. Yeah, it's all been ripped out. God, the power's been truly cut on here. Look at that wire stuck out. Only been, uh, been taped, look there. Yeah. See, it's this is the main junction box. So that's that's to stop the, that's top of somebody getting an electric shock. That's like this. Oh, I know. This religion's dying out. You know, I mean, how many churches? But ch yeah. even though religions die out, churches could still be used as community hubs for I mean, this, this church, children and uh, places even for part of history. Even yeah. even if you even if you're not religious, you could still do some religious activities. Like you could go singing in a church or something like I that. Like a religion, choir. No, you could still be a, you could still be part of a church choir or something. That's I'm even not, if I'm you're not, not religious to the you know, but for churches to be a religious symbol. Yeah. To a, fa to, to a faith. That's right, it's like... And but this could still be turned into a community hub or something. Yeah, go on then. And I lead you not into temptation and deliver you from evil because you have sinned. <laughs> you <laughs> have sinned, Sam. <laughs> That's it. You sound just like... You sound you just Sam? like... You, <laughs> you cowards! You whoremongers! Idolaters! Liars! Your place is in the lake of fire and sulfur, where you will die the second death, the death that burns and tears for all eternity. This is unbelievable. Look at just these woodies. Yeah, that one machine cut. That was that was creepy the way it's done, though. Creepy. Unbelievable. Yeah, it's the same sort of carvings as that, um, as that man who off the film The Haunting, which is two, which is 1999 film. Yeah. I don't know if you've ever seen it. Uh, it's got Liam Neeson, Catherine Zeta Jones in it. No, how's all the lights going on there? Yeah, <laughs> yeah but me using names of films in my, uh, me mentioning films and TV, TV shows in my, in my uh, video, <laughs> they give you one in credit. So this is the altar? This is the altar, yeah. I've been up, I took some pictures for, took, did take some pictures of the altar. What's he saying? Right? To the glory of God. And in loving memory of George Widowfield. What's that say? I don't know. Lieutenant First Mons, who made 
the supreme sacrifice, October the 14th, 1915. Probably the First World War, probably. Erected by his mother and relatives. Look at that, they've got just things silly like that, aren't they? I know, put a pentagram. Well, you know what that like. Well, I'm going to leave it there. Uh, please like, please subscribe, subscribe to Sam there and to uh, uh, Wayne from uh, Wayne's World. And I'll see you on the next.